was our defense. Uh, I think we had 11 straight uh, defensive uh, stop. Uh, we were just lucking up on defense, uh, playing together, communicate, play with a tremendous energy, and I think that was the reason why uh, we got that, that win. Terrence, what did Quincy give you guys down the stretch on both ends of the floor today, especially uh, late? <clears throat> I feel like Quincy did a really good job defending. Um, he gave us a big inside presence uh, being low um, in, against their zone. Um, and he, he, he offensive and defensive rebounded. Um, he was just a big body down there for us, and he was really key, key to the win. Quincy, you were big late against Kansas, and obviously in this one as well. How, how, how do you look at closing time? You've been in a lot of basketball games, obviously, in college. So uh, what's your approach in that, and how can you impact this team? I mean, my goal is just to find a way to win games. Um, like you said, I'm the oldest guy on the team, so I got to take pride in that. And, uh, you know, just being a leader out there, uh, make sure that everyone stay positive and find a way to win games. Sure, it seems like their the matchup zone caused you a little bit of problems early in the game. It take a while to, to kind of figure that out. Uh, yeah, man. I, I was just overthinking it and just just moving the ball and making the right play. Um, then we, we just settled in and... We started making plays offensively, but it was all good. Um, we got the wins. Hey, Terrence, you kind of just smothered the you know, goalkeeper for them. You know, they should just. Yeah. And was he at the top of the, the scouting report? Was maybe not let him get the shots like he did? Yeah, it was. And I, I told him I was going to do that. Uh, when I didn't did it, man. Uh, but he's a really good player. Uh, props to him. Uh, they got really good offensive scheme and. But we, we did a good job uh, guarding and defending it uh, during the week in practice. Yeah, in the last game, it was Dre that provided a spark off the bench. They seemed like it was you. What's kind of the mentality of you guys as a bench group on this team? Uh, for me, it's just, um, you know, I'm just doing what I can so we can get the dub. You know, uh, every day I try to come in with energy. Um, so, It's for either Dane or Quincy. There's a, a lineup late of you two and Coleman and, and TJ out there. It's a really good lineup. Uh, what does that give you guys, especially defensively? Uh, I, mean, I feel like it changed the game um, just with our rebounding, how much we were able to gain rebounds at the end of the game. Um, and they really had to just like close in a little bit in the paint. So that opened up for everybody else. For I mean, any of you, just against their zone, how important was it to get you know maybe the ball to Dane in the post and maybe get some of those? <clears throat> penetration and, and stuff like that. Um, when when they subbed in, uh, when he started sealing, uh, we we saw we could take advantage there. And during the timeout, so he just said to to feed him. And sometimes we missed him, uh, but that, that was a focal point to get it to Dane. Uh, and we drew a place for him to get it to him and let him go to work. Uh, he's a really good player in the post. Um, I feel like he's one of the best bigs in the country, and we're gonna need him. We're gonna need him in the long run. What have you guys learned in the three opportunities you've had? Obviously, one against ranked team, two against a lot of other teams. What have you learned about yourself going into your biggest test of the regular season here? I mean, defensively, is going to be a big key for us to win games. <laughs> like today, we were not shooting the ball well. Uh, free throw percentage was uh, terrible. Um, so we had to find a way to win the game without making shots. So like I said, defensively, is going to be a big key for us uh, going forward in the season. Uh, that should be our identity, and uh, we just got to keep working. I guess for the name of Terrence, so when your identity wants to be defense, like what, what does that require mentally from you guys, from a mindset to, to keep that energy over the course of a full game and then season? Uh, I mean, obviously, teams gonna score, um, but just but just being the same and sticking to our principles, uh, like throughout the like. That's like the start of the game, like I think it was like eight to zero and we just stayed in there, uh, locked in more and, and and figured out my, our mistakes. And throughout the game in the second half we got eleven stops straight. So just sticking to our principles and, and being solid and staying true to what we do, um, I feel like that's gonna be really good for us. Terrence you gotta ask, do you have a t shirt guy? Uh, where are you finding all these? Uh, so my friend, uh, she's back home, and uh, well, she actually lives in Houston, but she's from Chicago. Uh, but she has her own clothing brand, and she designed uh, a couple of shirts for me. Um, obviously, my boy Johnny. Um, 
We look like him today, actually. Um, but yeah, she's uh, she been Bianca. She's been a really real good helping me out with designs and stuff for the school. Do you have any more coming up? Yeah, I got some more coming up. This is a surprise. <laughs> this is a surprise.